Jessica, how are you today? I'm good. I haven't seen you in about, gosh, I don't know, almost two weeks. How have you been? I've been okay. What's new? I've been thinking about moving to another location. So you're currently in an apartment. You're thinking about getting another apartment, another area, another city, state. What, do you, what type of move? I'm thinking about going to another apartment. Okay. You're with roommates right now, you said, right? Yes. You don't like your roommates anymore? No. What happened? I don't like my roommates anymore because they don't let me do anything. What do you mean they tell you don't do this? Like what? They tell me to get out the kitchen and that I can't eat food and that I need to uh, go to the bathroom a lot and stuff like that. That sounds like parents, not roommates. Exactly. So basically you need new room roommates. Yes. What type of roommates are you looking for? I'm not looking for any roommates right now, actually. Okay, you're good to move on out by yourself? Yes. Okay, got it. Okay. Um, so hopefully that goes well. How soon are you looking to move? I'm looking to move within 10 weeks. Okay. And uh, I was talking to you. I was asking you um, if you had any siblings. No, I don't. No siblings, just you? Just me. Okay. And uh, how was your schooling uh, when you were in high school? How, how did that go? It was good. What type of student were you? A student? Yes. Okay. Did you have any ambitions to go to college? No. Okay, got it. And um, once you get your new apartment, are you going to be looking for like a job or what are your plans after that? I'm going to be looking for a job. Okay. Have you decided what type of job? No. Okay. You got 10 weeks to think about it, huh? Yes. Okay. And uh, your roommates were telling you not to go in the kitchen looking for food. But uh, last time I talked to you, you're trying the ice cube diet. How's that, how's that going for you? It's okay. Okay, is it working or? Yeah, it's working. Okay. And um, any plans for today? Like once, uh, once I leave here, like what are your plans for today? What are you trying to do? My plans for today is to make a consistent plan of how I'm going to surrender the rest of my thinking. Surrender the rest of your thinking for like the day? Yeah. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, when I met you, you're, you're, you're standing out there outside of a store. Um, how often do you go out there to like the store to just I to hang out? I go out there once every week. Once a week you're out there? Yes. Just trying to hang out with the community or what? Hustle. Trying to hustle some money? Yes. Okay. And uh, when you're hustling for money, like how successful are you with that? I'm not really successful because I only managed to buy one beer that cost a dollar fifty and then I just stopped getting money. So usually you make about two dollars, less than two dollars? Yes. When, you, when you're out there hustling? Yes. Man, it's time hey, it might be time for a for a job, huh? Yes. That might be more successful. I think uh, there are a lot of jobs paying like $15, $20 an hour right now. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So that's that might be a little bit more fruitful for you, right? Yeah. A better investment of your time? What do you think? No. No? Okay. Um, and uh, when you're out there in the streets hustling, um, why do you think there's so many young people out there trying to hustle as well instead of staying in school? They all want one thing and then they often change their mind. What's that one thing they're looking for? Drugs. In your opinion, are drugs good or bad? I think they're good. 
Why is that? <clears throat> because you could be at home and then all of a sudden you realize that you're already thinking about it. Has that happened to you before? You're at home and you're thinking about it? It has and <clears throat> and then I decided to turn up and that's why turn up like in what does that mean turn up turn up like turn up the volume on the radio and then I can and so that enough that that's enough for me to know like like why can't I you know but I can you know if I if I choose to make it incredible Okay, got it. Um, I was asking you if you have any children. No, I don't. If you were to become pregnant, what would you do? I'd take care of it, but I still wouldn't be happy. You don't think you'd be a good mom? No. Do you, uh, do you use birth control? Uh, yes and no. Okay. So just no ambitions to be a mom ever, huh? No. Okay. You know how sometimes there's a mom, there's a, there's women that like, that's, that's one of their goals, right? you know, to be a mom and raise a family and whatnot. That's not something you aspire to? No. Okay. Uh, last time you mentioned, uh, you told me about a boy that you had you hadn't seen in like four years. Yeah, I still haven't seen him. Okay. Do you look for him? Like, are yeah, you looking I for do. him every day? I do look for him every day. Do you know his name? Maybe he's watching this. So do you have a message in case he's watching? Sure. Um. Hey, I know that you're Manny and Abeha, and that your birthday is on June fourteenth, uh, and I really want to come over to your house so we can kick it and everything but I need you to pick me up first and if you can please let me know and I'll be here waiting for you bye and that's the Manny huh yeah when's the last time you saw him I saw him four years ago okay would you say it was like friendship or like a little love connection or it was friendship okay you just miss your friend Manny huh yes Okay, so I, I really hope that Manny sees this and he gets a hold. He gets a hold of me and says, "Hey, that's my friend Jessica. How can I get a hold of her? If 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 he's watching, he reaches out to me. You want me to go f uh, let you know right away, right?" Yes. Okay, that'd be cool, right? Yeah. Just a f you know four years uh, that you've been missing your friend Manny and and uh, as you say, you want to kick it, right? Yes. Cool. You you. You want to do like a little date, like just friends go out and eat, or what? What do you? What are you? Yeah, planning? I was thinking about going out and see and going to the movie theater, just to see what happens. Okay. And what type? What type of movies do you like? I like action movies. Okay. Do you know what type of movies Manny likes? No. You're gonna find out though, huh? Yes. It's awesome. Well, hopefully he reaches out. Okay, that's, you know, maybe there's a. It was here in Phoenix, right? It was here in Phoenix. And what happened? He moved away from that area? He did, yeah. Do you know, like, what area? Was he, did he, was he still in, F in Phoenix? or? No, he actually moved to the apartment I was looking at, actually. Oh, so you're trying to move back to that apartment yes. where he was at? Yes. Interesting. Okay. Maybe you find him before I do, huh? Yes. I'll race you. No, that's fine. <laughs> and, um, got it. So, I really do hope that he uh, reaches out and then we could do a little friend connection okay because okay. it looks like it's four years and you you remember everything about manny you remember a lot of details about manny mm -hmm, yeah you really liked him huh yeah i did what did you like about manny the most that he was five nine how tall are you five six and a half okay and was he nice to yeah he's nice okay long hair short hair no he has um short hair okay 
Interesting. I wonder if he still has, if he still looks the same that he did four years ago. What do you think? Yeah, I hope so. Okay. So, uh, Jessica, I'm going to say thank you very much for giving us an update. I'll, uh, we'll talk really soon. Uh, I'll let you know if Manny reaches out. And uh, in the meantime, please stay safe out here and uh, we'll talk again, okay? Okay, thank you.